Okay, so we're down to about the amount of sample that we want to hold on to before we get rid of the magnetite. So this is how you bag your sample, and this will also be how you remove your magnetite with a hand magnet. So this is my final, final sample bag. I usually put it in one of these and then double bag it with two. So the easiest way to bag your sample is just using the water. So, just nicely let it drip into your bag. You gotta be careful that it, with the extra weight, it doesn't pull it off of there. But if you're careful, you can get everything. So, Samples bagged. You can see all the nice dark mafic stripes in there. Fill it up the rest of the way. And so here I have a little hand magnet that's in a bag. And so you put that in its corner at the top of your sample in the water. So you can see the magnet right there. Hold it tight and then you just fluff it up a little bit. And then you let it settle. And with small grains of zircon and the other heavy minerals, you want to make sure you give it time to settle. That's why when we panned, we didn't get aggressive towards the end also. So now that it's settled, I do a little bit of a shake to make sure the rest of the non-magnetics didn't get stuck in the magnet and then there you go you see if I can focus this so there you can see all that magnetite that's gotten stuck so this magnetite I actually throw away I don't save it I don't do anything where I need the magnetic minerals also, you do not want to reuse this bag with your next set of samples either. You want to either really carefully wash it with soap and water or just use a different bag. So now, you can see the sample is still dark. There's other minerals in there that are possibly magnetic or just mafic. And so we can go back and do a second panning without magnetite getting in the way. So there you can see how dark the sample has ended up. You can see that we started with about three gallons of sample, and now we're ending up with about three, four tablespoons. So there you can see the separation, I think. So that's how you pan for heavy minerals. Thanks for watching.